Cristian, te doy la bienvenida a Cuba porque sé que estás aquí en un sentido mucho más estrecho que un enlace de internet. Ah, with this word, Mr. Assange, I give you the welcome to Cuba because I know you are closer to us than being on the link of internet. Uh, thank you, uh, Pedro. Can can you hear me, Cuba? All right. For for the moment, at least, uh, we managed to pass through the blockade around the embassy, uh, up into space, across the world, and down past the blockade on Cuba. So this moment that we have together reflects something important that's happening in the world. Uh, which is a way to bring uh, different parts of the world together to uh, breach through uh, such uh, extrajudicial, uh, coercive, uh, immoral blockades like the one uh, that Cuba suffers uh, and like the one that the WikiLeaks organization suffers. Porque permite romper un bloqueo, un bloqueo inmoral como el que está sufriendo Cuba y es algo que Wikileaks ha estado tratando de superar. And so bring about a new international solidarity, a new international body politic which becomes aware of itself and its values. Y traer un nuevo tipo de, solidar de solidaridad y traer un nuevo tipo de de conjunción entre las personas que están luchando por una misma causa. And once being aware of its values and unite together to fight for those values. Y es una forma de unirnos a todos para luchar por estos valores. The situation that Cuba has faced over the last 50 years is very interesting uh, to me, is very close to me. La situación que Cuba ha estado enfrentando en los últimos 50 años es muy interesante para mí, es muy importante para mí. Because why I have been fighting a blockade of my organization and my people uh, for about three years, uh, Cuba has fought a blockade for 50. Porque yo he estado luchando contra un bloqueo contra mi organización y mi gente por tres años y Cuba ha estado enfrentando un bloqueo que ha durado 50 años. And there are many similarities and I have learned some things about how Cuba has faced that restriction. Y hay algunas similitudes y hemos aprendido de las cosas que Cuba ha estado enfrentando en este tipo de asuntos. Uh, with determination uh, and with principle uh, and with unity. Con determinación, con principios y con unidad. Uh, but also with a lot of cleverness. Pero también con mucha inteligencia. Uh, similarly, uh, in the blockade against uh, the WikiLeaks organization, we have had to do the same thing, uh, yeah. to fight it with determination, uh, principle, unity, uh, and a lot of uh, very uh, clever tricks, and with the help of our friends. Y de la, una manera similar, nosotros tenemos que enfrentar el bloqueo que ha estado sufriendo Wikileaks con determinación, con nuestros principios y con una claridad ética. The origins of the U.S. blockade against Cuba, well, I do not need to tell you them, but they are the desire for Cuba to be an independent nation. Y la razón de este bloqueo contra Cuba, yo sé que no tengo por qué decírselas, es porque están en contra de que Cuba quiera tener su propia determinación. And the desire for the blockade against WikiLeaks comes from just one thing. El, Our desire to speak independently about the United States. Y el deseo que tienen ellos de bloquear a WikiLeaks viene de una sola cosa, de evitar que WikiLeaks hable con libertad acerca de las cosas que ha hecho Estados Unidos. To have self-determination in what we say 
history is. Y tener una autodeterminación en lo que estamos diciendo es lo principal. And similarly, for Cuba to have self-determination for its people. Es lo mismo, la autodeterminación que quiere tener Cuba para su pueblo. In response to the blockade against us, we have been uh, in a, a state of war uh, with the United States. En, los, en relación con este bloqueo, hemos estado en algo como una guerra contra los Estados Unidos. Uh, and it means that we have had to uh, become a different type of organization uh, in some respects to the organization uh, that we would be if we were not facing a blockade. I do not say that Wikileaks is a perfect organization. Yo no digo uh, like all of us, we are only two human. Una organización perfecta. Solo decimos que somos humanos. Uh, and I do not say that Cuba is a perfect nation. Like all nations, it has its problems. Y yo no digo que Cuba sea una nación perfecta, como todas las naciones tienen sus problemas. But what I do know, as someone who has led our way through and fought the blockade against my organization. Uh, for only just uh, three years, uh, what uh, limits that places on our ability to be everything that we would like to be. Pero lo que yo sí sé como una organización que ha estado enfrentando un bloqueo durante tres años es que no se puede frenar nuestra intención, nuestro deseo de ser lo que queremos ser. We started with a desire uh, to collect and protect the true history of the world. Nosotros empezamos con el deseo de recolectar y proteger la historia verdadera del mundo. Because it is from the history of who we really are that everything that is good is derived. Porque es desde la historia lo que realmente nosotros somos y podemos ser. Every human decision that occurs in the world occurs based upon what we know. Porque esto llama decisiones a partir de lo que nosotros sabemos en el mundo. And if we do not know our world, how can we possibly live in our world? Y si no sabemos lo que está pasando, ¿cómo, pues, cómo podemos vivir en este mundo? Our decisions are based upon the true history, including the recent history of what we are. Nuestra decisión se basa en la verdadera historia, incluyendo la historia de lo que somos. Or they are based upon a fantasy, an illusion, uh, or blackness. O de lo contrario estaría basada en una ilusión, en una ceguera, en algo oscuro. And it is only the decisions that are based upon who we truly are that can make sense in the real world that we live in. Y es solamente la decisión de saber quiénes somos realmente lo que nos hará tomar la decisión correcta en este mundo que estamos viviendo. Every other decision is like to roll a dice before Esto, the future. De hablar de las decisiones como lanzar unos dados ante el futuro. It shouldn't be the case that the true history of the world is so threatening to the government of the United States. No debe ser una verdad que la realidad, la historia real del mundo sea una amenaza para los Estados Unidos. But it is. Pero así es. If we go back to 2010, Salimos when we first started to publish uh, hundreds of thousands of uh, classified documents about the war in uh, Afghanistan. Nosotros comenzamos en el 2010 cuando publicamos miles de documentos que estaban relacionados con la guerra en Afganistán. The Pentagon made a press conference before the whole world to el, tell the whole world a demand. El Pentágono hizo una conferencia para todo el mundo. Le dijo a todo el mundo en ese momento. They demanded that WikiLeaks and me personally destroy everything that we had published from the Pentagon. 
demandaban que Wikileaks y yo personalmente destruyéramos toda la información que teníamos. They demanded that we destroy everything that we were going to publish from the Pentagon. Demandaron que destruyéramos todo lo que íbamos a publicar relacionado con el Pentágono. And they demanded that we cease uh, dealing with U.S. military whistleblowers. Y demandaron también que detuviéramos toda esta resistencia contra la cuestión militar norteamericana. Can you hear me, Cuba? Okay. Muchas gracias. Thank you very much. A mi nombre, por supuesto, y a nombre de todas las personas que están aquí. On my behalf, on, on behalf of all the people who are attending this meeting. Eh, quiero presentarte a Cristina. I would like to introduce you to Cristina Escobar. Eh, Cristina Escobar eh, te va a leer algunas preguntas. She will read you some questions eh, de, de las compañeras y los compañeros que están acá. From the people who are attending this place. Te las va a leer en inglés. She will read them to you in English. Y eh, procuraremos que sean preguntas breves. Muchas gracias. And we will try them to be brief questions. Thank you very much. Ms. Sanch, thank you very much for this huge opportunity for us, Cuban journalists and this group of students who are here. Really, thank you. And I'm not quite sure if you are aware of how moved we are because you're wearing a tie, a yellow ribbon. Thank you very much for that because it's a very important cause for us. Uh, I, I, I believe in the rights of these people, uh, just like I believe in the rights of my people. Uh, my lawyer, a very good friend of mine, Michael Ratner, uh, has fought for years uh, uh, for the freedom of the Cuban Five and represented uh, one of the uh, inter interventions in 2009 uh, in the Supreme Court uh, in the United States to try and have them released. So I am aware of the case. Yo, yo creo en el derecho de, esta, de estas personas. Soy amigo personal del abogado uh, y él, estuvo, él intervino en una de las sesiones en el 2009 y yo creo en el derecho de estas personas en su lucha. Um, our questions are gathered after our week in the workshop. Uh, it's from a couple of bloggers, journalists and young students who would like to have your opinion about certain issues, such as precisely the Cuban Pie case. You have been a victim of media manipulation. You are well aware of the power of the big media to lie. We have many cases like that here in Cuba. One of them is the manipulation of the Cuban Five trial. What's your opinion about how the Cuban Five trial was handled by the American media and do you have any suggestions about how the truth can come through? We live in a mediaocracy. That means every decision we make is based upon what we know. Nosotros vivimos en un estado mediático y las decisiones que tomamos se basan en lo que conocemos. Noam Chomsky has said that the media is uh, to democracy as the baton uh, is to a dictatorship. It is, it is a core ingredient for managing and controlling the decisions of people. Noam Chomsky dijo que los medios son como el bastón que puede tener cualquier dictador. The case. The case of the Cuban Five uh, is clearly an extremely political matter uh, in the United States. It's one of the more uh, obviously overtly politicized uh, cases. Uh, it is a, a disgrace that 
that in fact anyone uh, could spend uh, that long uh, in a US prison, uh, let alone uh, these five individuals from Cuba. El caso de los cinco cubanos es un caso muy politizado. Está abiertamente politizado. Nadie puede ser condenado a tanto periodo de, de prisión dentro de los Estados Unidos, como ha sido el caso de estos cinco cubanos. The Internet offers for the first time in a long time uh, the most powerful tool to break through the manipulation and control of the media. La Internet nos está ofreciendo una herramienta poderosa para romper contra la manipulación de los medios. And the success and power uh, of the Wikileaks organization and several others uh, represents that uh, ability. Y el éxito y el poder de Wikileaks representa esa posibilidad. For Cuba, it also represents the ability for Cuba to tell its own story. Y para Cuba representa la posibilidad de decir su propia historia. For all those who are willing to listen. Para que todo el mundo esté dispuesto o para que todos los que estén dispuestos a escucharla. But still we have a very big fight on our hands. Todavía tenemos una gran lucha en nuestras manos. The internet permits almost everyone uh, to say what is true. Internet le permite a casi todo el mundo decir lo que piensa que es verdad. But giant distribution companies try and fight the truth by diluting it. Pero hay algunas corporaciones gigantescas que están manipulando, manipulando esta situación. Not simply to censor the truth out of existence. Y a veces se resisten a darle un sentido a esta verdad. But to bury it, to bury it entirely in a sea of lies. De enterrarla totalmente. Uh, this is the challenge uh, that we all face now uh, to stop this um, most important tool of global civilization, which we can use to solve global problems, come to a new international consensus, a new body politic, from being captured on the one hand by massive distribution companies like uh, Disney or uh, Time Warner. Entonces, este es el reto que tenemos, enfrentarnos a estas grandes corporaciones como la Disney, la Time Warner, que están manipulando toda la información que está en Internet. And on the other hand, uh, to be captured by the United States and its allies as the largest, most aggressive worldwide surveillance machine ever. Y también que estamos capturados por los Estados Unidos como la máquina de vigilancia más poderosa que existe. This is the fight of our age. Esta es la lucha que tenemos en estos tiempos. We've debated another issue and we would like your opinion about this next question too. Nosotros debatimos otras cuestiones y quisiéramos saber su opinión con respecto a ella. Cuban blogger Joanny Sanchez presents herself as part of an independent opposition. La bloguera cubana Joanny Sánchez se presenta a sí misma como una opositora independiente. Nevertheless, Wikileaks has shown the close relation between Joanny and the American diplomats who work in Havana. Sin embargo, Wikileaks ha mostrado la relación entre Joanny y los diplomáticos norteamericanos en La Habana. The published documents demonstrate that the interview that she says she, will, she made to Barack Obama was fabricated. Los documentos prueban que la, interview, que, que la entrevista que ella le hizo a Barack Obama fue fabricada. All this information is relevant news. Why do you think the big media, the mass media, has not informed about it? Toda esta información es importante porque usted cree que los grandes medios han hecho silencio con respecto a esto. All media have an agenda. All media are funded by a particular mechanism, have friends, coming from a particular realm. Todos los medios tienen una agenda, todos los medios están enmarcados en los intereses de un grupo de personas. Those media who pretend uh, that they do not uh, come from a certain perspective are the ones that are the least trustworthy. Y esa, esos medios que, que vienen de una perspectiva diferente son los que la gente no quiere confiar. 
but we all must know what the agenda is. We must know what the perspective is. Pero debemos saber cuál es la agenda, cuál es la, la perspectiva. In this clash uh, of perspectives where we know the agenda, uh, we can distill uh, the truth. Y en este choque, cuando sabemos la agenda, podemos destilar la verdad. Of course, uh, the U.S. Uh, media is very close to the state in the United States. Por supuesto que los medios norteamericanos están muy cercanos al gobierno norteamericano. The media in the United States is the establishment media. Those are big, powerful organizations. Uh, and regardless of how they start, they end up uh, sitting at the table uh, with power. Y estos medios son medios del establishment. Y no importa cómo hayan comenzado, siempre terminan sentándose a la mesa con los que representan este establishment. And becoming its agent. Y se convierten en sus, en sus agentes. In our publication of the U.S. diplomatic cables, uh, we documented a great range of censorship. En nuestros documentos, con estos de estos diplomáticos, eh, eh, publicamos muchos cables que tienen que ver con esta situación. You can have a look at cabledrum.net and we detail thousands of instances of the Western media uh, removing uh, paragraphs or sentences uh, from our cables. Y van a ver que la, los medios occidentales han borrado párrafos y oraciones de nuestros cables. I, I must say that uh, Cuba has no need to fear the truth. Yo debo decir que Cuba no tiene necesidad de esconder la verdad, de enfrentar la verdad. The reality of its situation means it does not need to fear the truth. What it needs to fear is lies. La realidad de la situación no causa la necesidad de temer de la verdad. Se le debe temer a la mentira. We can sometimes feel uh, here and there that the truth will sting us. Podemos sentir aquí y allá como la verdad se mantiene. But when your big enemy uh, uh, is a sea of lies, the truth is your friend. Y vemos al enemigo hundido en un mar de mentira diciendo que es su amigo. And we can see that in the uh, U.S. diplomatic cables that we released about Cuba. Y vemos eso, hemos visto eso en los cables diplomáticos de Cuba. These were even written from the perspectives of uh, U.S. ambassadors. Esto se escribió incluso bajo la perspectiva del embajador norteamericano. But still, overall, uh, the uh, inside perspective uh, uh, favored Cuba's struggle. Y siempre es una generalidad que va a caer dentro de la perspectiva de la lucha cubana. In relation to people like like Sanchez, I have seen this in many different countries. En relación con Joan Sanchez, he visto esto en algunos países, en diferentes países. There are problems with all countries. Hay, uh, hay problemas. It is, it is important for people to uh, talk about the problems in their country. Y es importante que las personas hablen de los problemas en sus países. But it is also extremely important uh, to not um, be to become a puppet uh, of another country. Pero también es importante no convertirse en un títere de otros países. To become corrupted in that way. Hacer corromperse en ese sentido. Funding of uh, opposition voices uh, by the U.S. government, uh, by the Swedish government, uh, and others Dan has had a very negative effect. Darle fondos a las voces opositoras y a otro tipo de elementos tiene un efecto muy negativo. Because now when we see a Cuban blogger uh, saying something about Cuba, we don't know uh, what is their agenda. Porque cuando vemos a un bloguero decir algo sobre Cuba, no sabemos cuál es su verdadera agenda. Are they complaining about a matter that is genuine uh, and should be reformed? Si están quejándose de un asunto que sea genuino, real. Or are they effectively a propaganda uh, agent of the United States? O se están, están actuando como un agente de propaganda para los Estados Unidos. 
this behavior uh, in, I'm not speaking about this particular case because I don't know the details, but this behavior in general of accepting money uh, and resources from the United States uh, tarnishes uh, all people who have complaints. Uh, uh, removing credibility uh, from all, all of them, even those who are genuine. Incluso aunque sea algo genuino. We would like to know a little bit more also about your case, and we have a question about it. Quisieron saber un poco más acerca de su caso y tenemos una pregunta con respecto a eso. Anna Ardin has been related with terrorist organizations that are against Cuban revolution, which are in Miami and who have worked with the CIA for more than 50 years. Ana Arden ha sido vinculada con grupos terroristas y contrarrevolucionarios de Miami que han estado afectando durante más de 50 años. The accusation that Arden made against you could be related with her close relation with the CIA. La acusación que Arden le hizo usted pudiera estar, relacion estar relacionada con la CIA. The I have not been charged uh, with an offence. It may be surprising to some of you, uh, but I have not been charged uh, in the UK uh, or in Sweden at any time. Uh, but I have been detained uh, for over three years, and there is an attempt uh, to extradite me uh, to, uh, to Sweden. A mí no se me ha acusado formalmente durante estos tres años. Se me ha tenido retenido para ser llevado a juicio en Suecia. At the, at the same time, the U.S. government <clears throat> is conducting what it calls a whole-of-government investigation of unprecedented scale and nature into me and my publishing organization. Y los Estados Unidos me está acusando y de una manera de una manera específica lo que ellos llaman como un asunto. One of my alleged sources, Private Bradley Manning, uh, well, I mean, has you, just been sentenced to 35 years in prison Manning in the United States. The only allegation against him is that he provided me with information to communicate to the public. No allegation that even a single person uh, was hurt as a result of those publications. No hay ningún, no se alega nada de que ninguna persona ha sido dañada por estas publicaciones. No allegation that he received any money uh, for providing us allegedly with that information. No se puede alegar de que no haya recibido ningún dinero por parte nuestra por esos documentos, esa información. No allegation that he wanted to uh, make revenge. Uh, on the United States. No, hay, no se puede alegar que le haya querido dañar a los Estados Unidos. Just that he wanted to communicate the truth about the war in Afghanistan and uh, the criminal aspects of U.S. foreign policy Solo to the world. Ha, ha querido hablar la verdad de la guerra en Afganistán y de la naturaleza criminal de los Estados Unidos en esta política. Within the context of these two cases, uh, the uncharged investigation in Sweden, which was uh, previously uh, completely dropped. And this uh, enormous ongoing effort to dismantle the WikiLeaks organization uh, and prosecute me. The uh, government of Ecuador uh, granted me political asylum. El gobierno de Ecuador me otorgó asilo político. Now the UK government refuses to recognize international law uh, and permit me to receive that asylum in Ecuador. Y el gobierno británico se rehúsa a reconocer este derecho internacional para yo recibir asilo político en Ecuador. Trapping me in the embassy for 500 days. Y me tienen atrapado durante por 400 días en esta embajada. In relation to uh, 
the person you spoke about and their activities in Cuba. We are, of course, I am very interested in that. Uh, but because the case is also uh, uh, ongoing and legal in its nature, it is difficult for me to speak about it. However, we, we just filed two criminal cases uh, in Sweden and in Germany. About the intelligence activities against me in those two countries at that time in 2010. Acerca de la actividad de inteligencia contra mí en esos dos países en el, en el año 2010. And if you go to wikileaks.org, uh, you can see uh, the uh, hundred, so the 200 page uh, filing detailing those activities. Y si usted entra en el sitio de wikileaks.org, va a haber 200 páginas que documentan todas estas actividades contra mí. Do you what, what do you feel about the fact that probably in some moment you may be judged in Sweden or in the United States? ¿Cómo usted se siente acerca del hecho que en algún momento pueda ser juzgado en Suecia o en los Estados Unidos? Do you insist in the need of save yourself and keep WikiLeaks working? ¿Usted ha insistido en salvarse y mantener a WikiLeaks funcionando? Would you think that's possible even though if, if you are not there for WikiLeaks? ¿Será eso posible aunque usted no esté ahí para Wikileaks? Cuando estaba en prisión, en solitario confinamiento en este país, sin charge, por uh, 10 días, nuestro equipo siguió publicando. En fact, they, they like to joke uh, that we publish more in those 10 días uh, than the normal 10 días, uh, because I wasn't there. Cuando yo um, estuve detenido durante 10 días, se publicaron y se hizo, fue con una cuestión de jocosa, un chiste de que se publicó más durante esos 10 días que yo estuve retenido que antes. Uh, I have complete confidence in our people to, uh, to continue uh, the organization, even if I'm in a very difficult position. I have been in several difficult positions. That said, um, uh, the organization would lack something of its central guiding uh, spirit. Uh, perhaps in the same sense that, um, uh, that uh, even though Fidel Castro is not um, leading uh, in a formal sense Cuba now, uh, his, um, um, the, the authenticity uh, of uh, his um, original motivation uh, is still present and important. Yo eh, tengo toda la confianza en las personas de mi organización y pienso que van, van a continuar realizando el trabajo, aunque yo no esté presente. Es como el caso de Fidel Castro. Como figura, tal vez no puede estar dirigiendo el país, pero su autenticidad se mantiene en que el país va a continuar haciendo. En relación a lo que pasa si estoy en los Estados Unidos, bueno, sabemos de Bradley Manning lo que va a pasar. Um, uh, that is not going to happen. It is not going to happen. Uh, similarly, similarly uh, a transfer out of Sweden to the United States uh, or uh, crushing me in Sweden is not going to happen. It is not going to happen for a very simple reason, uh, because we're not going to let it happen uh, and because our friends are not going to let it happen, uh, because uh, governments like Ecuador uh, have seen Uh, what is happening in this situation, have, uh, uh, have uh, assessed it, and their people uh, have given the government the correct uh, political will uh, to say this is not going to happen. En cuanto a ser enjuiciado los Estados Unidos, todos sabemos lo que puede pasar, porque hemos visto lo que pasó con Manning, pero eso no va a suceder, no vamos a permitir que suceda. El gobierno de Ecuador tiene la voluntad política de evitar que eso suceda y nosotros no vamos a permitir que eso suceda. Similarly, when the US uh, and the Pentagon demanded to the world that we destroy everything uh, that we had published, we're going to publish 
and cease functioning as an organization, or else we would be compelled to do so. That's the words of the US government, compelled. Um, we said, no, that's not going to happen. Uh, and we did not destroy a single document. Uh, we published all the documents we were going to publish. Uh, and the organization continues on. Uh, it comes from the, the will uh, and strength and solidarity to say, no, that is wrong. It is not going to happen. De la misma manera que no sucedió cuando el Pentágono nos dijo que teníamos que destruir todos los documentos que teníamos. Eso no sucedió, no lo hicimos. Recibimos más solidaridad y nos hicimos más fuertes como organización. Eso no va a pasar. We Cuban journalists admire the cause of Wikileaks and your cause. We... Nosotros los periodistas cubanos admiramos la causa de Wikileaks y su causa. We share your values and we understand your situation as well as the Cuban people. Compartimos sus valores y entendemos su situación como pueblo cubano. What can Cubans do to help Wikileaks defeat the U.S. blockade? ¿Qué puede hacer Cuba para ayudar a Wikileaks a derrotar el bloqueo? Very interesting question. Well, you know, uh, WikiLeaks, in order to deal with the blockade, we've had to start um, bank accounts in lots of different countries. We have made many different lawsuits. Uh, we have uh, made motions at the European Parliament, some of which have succeeded. Complaints at the European uh, Commission started up organizations uh, in the United States, like the Free Press Foundation, to try and work around uh, these blockades, uh, done special things in France to try and work around them, etc. Uh, and Cuba has a very similar experience, uh, trying methods to work around the blockade and also to draw attention uh, to what is going on. So I think um, to draw this parallel uh, with the, the groups that Cuba is used to drawing that parallel with, to say, look, this is the same sort of situation uh, that WikiLeaks faces. It's a very modern thing. Uh, maybe you've all gotten bored of the Cuban blockade and talking about that, but it's not just Cuba. This sort of uh, political uh, censorship of um, economy and information flow. This is something the United States is not just applying to Cuba. It's applying to other organizations as well. Um, and who's going to be next? The reality is there is no self-determination. There is no sovereignty uh, without economic sovereignty. Uh, there is no... Uh, proper uh, sense of a nation or a community uh, without information uh, sovereignty, without being blockaded in and isolated in terms of information flow. Um, these are very important matters, uh, not just for states, uh, but for also for organizations, groups, communities, uh, and languages. Well, Y pienso que Cuba debe hacer lo mismo, llamar la atención sobre esta situación en los Estados Unidos y fuera de los Estados Unidos. Es lo primero que hay que hacer. Lo, la otra situación es tener la voluntad política, you said political willingness, you said that as a tool. But, but speaking specifically, um, well, we always need uh, many people for many different things. It's... Uh, we're running a, a global organization that has had 95% of its income blockaded, 95%. Um, and of course, our people are under all sorts of uh, investigations and threats and activities by the FBI done unlawfully in different countries. Uh, the Icelandic government found formally uh, that the uh, US had uh, deployed secret FBI agents to Iceland to interfere uh, with our activities. Um, you will know, of course, about this situation with Edward Snowden that we are involved in in managing to uh, help him get out get out of Hong Kong safely and secure his asylum uh, in uh, Russia and also secure asylum offers uh, from other countries uh, in Latin America. Ustedes han visto lo que han, hemos visto que con muchos agentes nuestros en muchos gobiernos se les ha estado investigando, se les ha estado siguiendo. Nosotros hemos informado a todas esas agencias lo que estaba pasando con nuestras personas. 
en caso de Snowden, ayudamos a que saliera de Hong Kong para estar con seguridad en Rusia. That has, that has not made us uh, the favorite media organization of the world in Washington. Eso no nos ha hecho la organización de los medios más favoritas en el mundo. No nos ha, no nos ha convertido en eso. Uh, so, uh, if you want to help in some uh, concrete way, and we're a big organization, um, so there are many different things that we do, uh, then speak to someone who knows us, uh, maybe uh, Pedro Miguel, for example. So, if you want to help us with concrete things, talk with people who know us about all of this situation. Yes, we have talked to Pedro Miguel. We've had a very productive workshop with him. He has told us a lot about Wikileaks, Edward Snowden, Bradley Manning, yourself, and it's been a very, very interesting week because we've known uh, closer your story. Hemos hablado con Pedro Miguel, nos ha contado durante esta semana muchas cosas acerca de Wikileaks y hemos estado más cerca de lo que es Wikileaks. In a way, Wikileaks has already helped Cuba because has said, has demonstrated with the leaks that you've done, uh, a bunch of things that the United States is doing against Cuba. De cierta manera, Wikileaks ha ayudado a Cuba porque con lo que usted ha publicado hemos tenido conocimiento de ciertas cosas que los Estados Unidos han estado haciendo a Cuba. The documents are the proof of things that we already know that are happening but are very important for us. Estos documentos son la prueba de cosas que sabíamos que estaban pasando. Por eso es que son tan importantes para nosotros. But we would like your opinion or maybe information that we don't know about, what can Wikileaks do to help Cuba to defend, defeat the U.S. blockade? Pero quisiéramos saber su opinión para, para que nos diga qué puede hacer Wikileaks para ayudar a Cuba a derrotar el bloqueo. Cuba has a lot more experience with this. You know, I think we have a lot more to learn uh, from, from Cuba. Uh, about how to, how to deal with the blockade, but um, we're, we've been um, in the past three years fighting us, and I suppose there are perhaps some lessons uh, about how Wikileaks has been fighting its blockade. Um, but I am, you know, it's been hard work for us to fight a blockade that has uh, taken 95% um, of our revenue uh, over three years. Uh, and uh, together with many other uh, types of attack uh, that the US government uh, has made. Uh, and to do this for uh, more than 50, to do this for 50 years. Um, when you're only uh, 80 miles from the coast of Florida, I am immensely impressed. Estando solo 90 millas de los Estados Unidos, yo estoy altamente impresionado. I know something of how hard it is, but uh, I do not know what it is like to do it for 50 years. Es algo que uno hace, pero no sé cómo ustedes lo han podido hacer durante 50 años. But I, I think this point of... Um, the right to economic sovereignty and economic self-determination. Y pienso que este punto de la economía, la, so la soberanía en la economía es importante. And the right to informational sovereignty uh, and informational self-determination. A la soberan soberanía en cuanto a la información y la autodeterminación. And these being an international right that the international, international community must try uh, and enforce for everyone's benefit. A right that must not be abridged, uh, at least without the um, authority of the UN uh, Security Council or other international bodies. Pero no se va a crear este puente si no hay al menos una intervención de las Naciones Unidas or the, or the organizations important. This is a right that many people uh, can agree on. Esto es un derecho en el que muchas personas van a estar de acuerdo. No organization wants to have <coughs> what has been done to WikiLeaks happen to them. 
ninguna organización va a querer que le pase a ellos lo que le ha estado pasando a Wikileaks. Uh, and no country and no people uh, want uh, to be blockaded uh, in the appalling manner uh, in which Cuba has been blockaded. Ninguna persona, ningún país va a querer estar bloqueado como lo ha estado bloqueado Cuba. But that said, uh, esto, blockade is not all bad. El bloqueo no está terminado. Within WikiLeaks, it has caused us to diversify. Y lo que ha hecho en WikiLeaks es que nos ha permitido diversificarnos. To have many different economic uh, relationships. Uh, so when one is grabbed by the United States, we can continue to survive. Y tenemos muchas relaciones económicas. Así que cuando una es tomada por los Estados Unidos, el resto nos permite sobrevivir to become self-reliant. Para ser autosoportados. And I also see this happening in Cuba. Y veo que esto también ha estado pasando en Cuba. Um, Mr. Assange, your example is your, your strength, or your, your determination is an example for us. Su fuerza y su determinación es un ejemplo para nosotros. We thank you for your time. It's a huge opportunity for us. Les agradecemos su tiempo. Es una gran oportunidad para nosotros. And we cannot thank you enough for no wearing today. Y no podemos darle suficientes gracias por haber estado hoy llevando un lazo amarillo. Thank you very much. Muchas gracias. Thank you so much. Keep fighting. Never give up. Querido Julian, Dear no Julian, vayas, no te vayas, no te please vayas. don't go. <laughs> I come back. Regrese. <laughs> okay. Be me and one. <laughs> Muchas gracias. Uh, Julian, uh, hay aquí decenas de jóvenes cubanos uh, con mucho talento, con uh, mucha pasión periodística. We con... have tens of young youth people here with a lot of passion and a lot of talent in journalism, eh, con mucha habilidad tecnológica, with quite technological abilities. Eh, hay otros no tan jóvenes. There are some others who are not that young. Eh, nos habría gustado ser cientos o miles en esta sala. We would sala. like to have been thousands in this room. Pero eh, las limitaciones técnicas, eh, en parte debido al bloqueo, nos han impedido hacer algo más. But technical limitation, partly due to the blockade, has not allowed us to do more. Yo sé que lo que tú nos has hablado ahora eh, se va a quedar en el corazón y en el cerebro de estas compañeras y de estos compañeros. I know that what you have spoken to us, your words will remain in the hearts and brain of these young people here and people here present. Eh, Quiero agradecer a, a Joel, a Alejandro, a I Carlos. I want to thank Joel, Alejandro, Carlos. Eh, a Karen. Karen. Que han hecho un excelente trabajo they técnico. They have done an excellent technical work. Y a nuestro compañero de aquel lado del Atlántico. And our comrade on the other side of the Atlantic Ocean. Eh, y quiero hacer un agradecimiento muy especial. And I would like Hello, everyone. to be very grateful. A alguien que ha seguido. <laughs> to somebody who has followed. <laughs> que ha seguido eh, este enlace con This mucho interés link with a lot of interest. Eh, y que ha tenido eh, además la educación de no interrumpir en ningún momento. And he momento. has been polite enough not to interrupt us. Me refiero a Barack Obama. And I uh, am referring to Barack Obama. <laughs> eh, que sabemos que nos está escuchando. That we know he's listening to us. Eh, yo le deseo verdaderamente que aprenda algo. I really wish him that he should learn something. Que aprenda, eh, un poco de decencia y de honestidad. He should learn about decency and honesty. Y, eh, con esto te digo que, por supuesto, no vas a ir a juicio en Estados Unidos. And with this I'm telling you that, that of course you're not going to be on the trial in the United States. Porque sé que hay sociedades que están eh, eh, respaldando la causa de Wikileaks y la tuya. Because uh, that I know there are some societies supporting your cause and the cause of Wikileaks. Espero que esta plática sea el inicio de una relación muy estrecha, muy cordial y muy solidaria. And I hope that this talk will be the beginning of a very close relationship and cordial relationship. 
entre Wikileaks y eh, los estudiantes, los periodistas de Cuba. Between Wikileaks and the students of journalism and the journalists from Cuba. Y eh, espero que pronto puedas tomar un avión de Quito a La Habana. And I hope that soon enough you can get, can get a plane from Quito, Ecuador to Havana. Porque eh, tenemos que tomarnos un trago. Because we need to have a drink here. En esta ciudad maravillosa. In this wonderful city. Muchas gracias. Julio. Thank you very much. Uh, Thank you, Pedro. I think uh, many drinks actually will be call called for uh, when I get to Cuba. A great many. <laughs> Thank you. Gracias a los del taller, eh, gracias a Rosa y Roela.